Hey guys, welcome to this two minute book review. We don't have a lot of time, so we better get started. This book is about a local woman who discovers that a series of advertisements in the newspaper feature women who have gone missing. She dives into it with the help of a local detective and naturally drama ensues. When I worked in the city, I did the same thing every day. I left for the train at the same time. I would wait in the same spot. I would even sit in roughly the same spot on the train. I would wear the same coat, carry the same bag, stuck in this false sense of security we all find from routine. Claire McIntosh had a great concept for this book in that she took that very feeling of routine and security and she takes it away and builds an incredible sense of paranoia. It's a book that will no doubt cause you to look over your shoulder if you decide to read it on your morning commute. The thing that I loved most about this book was how well the author built this sense of paranoia. She did a great job of leaving tons of breadcrumbs, so much so that even I, who read mystery thrillers almost constantly, could not figure out who the culprit was. I had genuinely no idea. So that was really fun for me for a change. However, towards the end, I started to have a few problems with the book. Uh, mostly, I started to feel like, can we just get on with it already? And that we were building almost too much suspense and just taking too long to really get anywhere. My other problem was that I didn't feel that the criminal psychology was really well in place. This author is an ex-cop, so that did surprise me a little bit. And I'm sure she knows more about that than me. But as far as a fiction book was concerned, I didn't feel like I was getting that criminal psychology that I've sort of learned to crave. The actions of the ultimate villain uh, didn't make sense to me, and so that kind of ruined some of the authenticity of the read. And I'll admit, I did have a little bit of trouble visualizing some of the scenes. But all in all, it's a great read to read on your morning commute if you want to feel paranoid. It'll definitely have you looking over your shoulder, searching for that pair of eyes that aren't afraid to meet yours. And that is it for this two minute book review of I See You. For more information, there is a link in the description box. Can I tell you something? If you liked this video, you're gonna like the next one. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and hey, leave me a comment below because I love talking to you guys. All right, I'll see you in my next video.